This is the second of the three gorges we came through. I talked earlier on, but the lady was, um, the guide was talking very loudly. For, for moments on end, she never stopped in either Chinese or, or English. And uh, she was talking about what was on the left side, but it appeared to me only that it was incredibly tall and incredibly impressive and green covered and granite and so on. But I don't know, I don't know if she indicated something special I didn't hear about. And there are 50 meters under the water and the cave is 8 kilometers deep into the mountain. 8 kilometers deep into the mountain. And you can see many swallows nests hanging Huge on the ceiling cave. of the cave. That's the Chinese medicine. So we come out of yet another gorge. Still building this bridge here. Just before we went under this bridge, they came over and told everybody to get under cover, I guess in case anything fell on them from this bridge still being built. Getting into even smaller boats, I presume to go up a shallower part of the river. Bridge. <laughs> oh, I love to get on there. I wouldn't, but... If you have any requests or questions, you may ask me at Annika. I'll do my best to help you. I wish you have a good trip. Can you hear me, everyone? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, first here, the two boatmen will get off the boat and the pull it up with the tow rope to make the demonstration for us. Because you know, before the music, ropes running is down to the boat. I don't really know what they're doing. No. They yeah, seem to be tethering all the boats yeah, to the hillside. Uh, if you, if you like, you can stand up to take the picture. By the guys on the hillside. So every boat is tethered to people on the hillside above, running or walking along a path, and thereby pulling the boats. Very hard work to climb the hill with the rope and then run along the hillside. Ah, yeah. <laughs> they got it caught in the bushes here. <laughs> I'm not sure about uh, this bridge uh, here because for nothing on this side. For this is for a show, you mean? Basically uh, nothing yeah. on the okay, other side, I so why yeah, anybody yeah, would yeah. want to cross because, you know, from one wilderness to another is rather oh, mysterious. Uh, most of the stone are belong to the limestone. So normally, stalactites, stalactites will smell like mud on the, on the rocks with strange shapes. This is natural, so you may use your imagination. Maybe sometimes in this area. In this area, uh, here we just turn around and go back. When we go back, it's a little faster because we just to go down the street. Ooh, all right. When we come here, we go up the street. <laughs> So if you like, I just uh, invite our, uh, one of our boatmen to see a star with me, okay? Yeah. <laughs> That was quite a trip. Those hard-working guys, Jesus Christ. 
Three rowing at the front, one rowing at the back, and one of the sort of guiding hole.